Hello everyone. Happy blessed Juneteenth 2020. Today I was asked by the Memphis City Library to speak at their Juneteenth celebration on a Zoom broadcast. I spoke on the history of Juneteenth and that black lives still matter. History of Juneteenth, black lives still matter. Abraham Lincoln issued the Emancipation Proclamation on January 1, 1863. It was the important first step leading to the 13th Amendment for all slaves to be free. This was the third year of the Civil War and resistance was great in the Confederate States. Many slaves never heard the good news of freedom because news traveled slow and for them it came late. It wasn't until June 19, 1865 two years later the news reached the slaves in Texas and other parts. They learned that they were free and the Juneteenth celebrations began with much rejoicing from their hearts. The newly freed men and women went about to make a new start. They were the first to show that black lives really do matter and they set about to change the damages that had been done. They enlisted in the Union Army in droves. They sought to reunite their broken families established schools for their children, and for political office they did run. Juneteenth is crucial to our heritage. It is Black Americans Independence Day. We must remember it is the day each year we claim as our own liberty and freedom, that we too are Americans and we celebrate in a very special way. This year 2020 has brought news of a viral pandemic that has affected the whole wide world where thousands of lives have been taken. 2020 has also exposed the greater virus of systematic racism and police brutality that has sparked worldwide protest where the Black Lives Matters movement has truly awakened. The question I leave to each of you today is, as we celebrate Juneteenth, what part will you play? Will you march? Will you pray? Will you teach your children and let them know that Juneteenth is important and that we must never stop standing, never stop resisting injustice and racism in any form? Because as it was then, it still is now that black lives matter.